Hi, it's Andy again from EasySoft Limited here. Today we're going to look at installing the EasySoft Interbase ODBC driver onto Windows. Now for this you're going to need to have activated your free EasySoft Limited account. Just go to easysoft.com if you haven't already got one. Download the Interbase ODBC driver. You'll need an active connection into Interbase. An internet connection because we're going to apply for the free trial license online and just a couple of minutes of your time. Okay, let's start this demo. Okay, I've already downloaded the EasySoft ODBC driver from easysoft.com. So let's start by installing this software. Uh, obviously read through the terms and conditions and then accept them. And we'll install this in the default location. That's it, that's uh, the driver installed. We just need to launch the license manager now so we can uh, request a license. Okay, we need these details from you. The email address is particularly important. Uh, this has to match the email address that you um, signed up to easysoft.com with. Uh, the telephone number. Uh, we also need it will help us to help you if you have uh, any support questions with us uh, okay so we request a license uh, time limited license because we don't have any um, authorization code uh, yes it's the ODBC interbase driver that one uh, so it's picked up my details here, now knows that what we want to, uh, what license we want, so I'll make an online request, and that's it, one license added already. So we click OK to that, uh, I can show you the license here, and this one's going to expire on April the 11th. So I just finished that. Um, right. With this, I'm actually using a 32-bit application on a 64-bit operating system. So I just need to uh, run the 64-bit uh, um, ODBC uh, data source administrator. So I'll click on Start Run. Uh, I need a percentage wind. Yeah, yeah. Percentage backslash this. Wow, yes, there it is. Sis wow 64 for, uh, backslash uh, ODBC AD 32.exe. So run it, running this now as 64 bit. Click add. It's the eSoft interface ODBC driver. Uh, that I want to add as a new data source. Okay, the uh, DSN, I shall call it, uh, this can be anything you want. Uh, I shall call this the EasySoft IB, the EasySoft Eterbase. It's the EasySoft Limited Interbase ODBC as my description. Uh, the database, what I'm doing in this instance, I'm just pointing it towards the uh, demo one that you get with uh, the interbase um, installation. So I've done that. The username is DBA. Password is in there. The only other thing I need to check on here because I'll be getting the data back into uh, Microsoft Access is to check this default SQL char. Uh, I shall test that. And the uh, connection test completed successfully so we know all the details of, of, uh, are correct. Click OK. Click OK. Now if I open up MS Access. And if I set up a new blank database, create that, and I want to link 
to the tables I'll take a look uh, important in types of file that we do ODBC databases uh, if I click on machine data source it's got the databases in here it's got my um, data source in there that's set up earlier click on name uh, I'll select all bring them all over I will use employee number as my unique identifier and there you go um, so what we've done there is we've installed the uh, EasySoft Interbase ODBC driver uh, and we've just retrieved the Interbase data from the database and imported them into Access. I'm sure you'll agree that the whole process was really quite simple. Um, now we'd have 14 days trial with the fully function uh, ODBC driver here to prove it on my own live system and you will too. Uh, ESOF Limited can help you with your data access for our full range of ODBC and JDBC drivers, bridges and gateways. You just need to visit ESOF.com. Be sure to let us know if you have any comments or questions. Until next time, thanks again and we'll see you again soon.